Hey, hey, survivors, welcome back for another episode of How To. Today's episode is on how to build a basic house. This is something that you're going to have to start off the game building one for yourself, and then you're going to be building more and more for each of your settlers. So you might as well get used to it. Building the house is pretty much a simple thing to do, but there is a little bit of a trick. You can change the walls to a wall that you like. Let me show you what's going on. To build a house, you're going to need a hammer. Now, if you don't have a hammer, you always can build one by hitting the Q button, going down to handcrafting, and here with one log and 10 sticks, you can build a wooden hammer. You're also going to need logs to get you started. Go ahead and let's pick up the logs. Now, to build the house, we need to get into the crafting menu. So Q button, building, and then houses. Now there are up to three houses that you can build depending on what level of the game you are. The simple small house is your most basic house that requires six logs to get started. The top one here, simple house, is eight logs and then 10 logs for just a regular house. So starting off with a simple log, or excuse me, a simple small house, six logs, let's left click, and here you have the house. If it's red, obviously you can't place it down. If you find a nice flat piece of land, then you're able to place it down there. Now if you notice, the higher up it gets, the ladder or the stairs changes a little bit. So keep that in mind. It's how you want it to look. Also keep in mind, by hitting the Q and the E key, you can actually rotate it. Now if you don't want to continue this and you just want to exit out, hit the right mouse button and it cancels out of there. To get back to it, Q, building, houses, simple small house. Here it is. This is where I want it to be. I'm going to go ahead and left click and drop it down. Now we have an outline of what the house looks like. Now if you do not have the hammer in your hand, you don't see the blue. All you see is just a simple outline of the actual house. Bring up your hammer, and as long as you're in the building mode for that hammer, you see the outline of the house. Now you can come inside, and these walls are actually not there. Now, you can build it as is. All you need is two logs and six sticks. So let's come over here. Let's grab some sticks. Come over here and hold the left button and keep holding it. As long as you have the inventory of the item, it'll keep going. So right there is the basic wall for the house. That's called a water wall. And if you keep going, this is going to be a water wall with a window but you actually can change this to a different style. If you hold or just hit the E key, it brings up different options here. You have to decide what is it you're looking at. This is a wall with a window. Do you want this to be a wall with a window? So if you hit the E key, I do, I want it to be a wall with a window. So you select this one hitting the left mouse button. And here you decide, do you want it to be a water wall? Do you want it to be a wooden wall or do you want it to be a stone wall? If you check wooden wall, then now it's going to require four logs to build. That's the difference between the two walls. Now you come over here to this one here, hit the E key. See, there's no window. Now I can choose a window if I want and it'll put a window there. Here's a window. If I want it to be just a regular wall, but I want it to be a stone wall, and now this will be a stone wall. So it requires one log and then eight stone. Let's go ahead and pick up our stone. And here you have a stone wall. Now keep in mind, this is the most basic wall, a water wall, a wooden wall, and a stone wall. It also is less quality of insulation, medium quality of insulation, and a higher quality of insulation. 
So if you're wondering why your people are not very happy, it might be the simple fact that they don't have the highest quality of insulation. And you can do that for any of the walls inside here. Go ahead and hit the E key. Let's say I want a window here and I want it to be a water wall. It can be that way. This one here. I took the hammer away. You do not see any walls. Bring the hammer back up. You see the walls. Now, here's a catch. Here it says a wall with doors. You cannot make a doorway. This right here is the only doorway for this building structure. I can change that doorway to something else if I was over there, but I've already built it, so I can't change it. So here I cannot select this because it says the building already has a door. Now you cannot tear this down and then put a door over here. It's built in to where this is the door and that's it. There's no other way to change that, so keep that in mind. But here you can go ahead and tell it what kind of walls you want. And then this also works with the ceiling. Here the ceiling is a simple thatched wood. If we grab some straw, this right here is a simple thatch roof made of straw. That is the, la the most basic layer of a roof. We can change it by doing the same thing, hitting E and choosing a wooden roof, choosing E and a wooden tire roof, E, a thatch roof, and then the sides here, you can make this the same thing. A water wall, a wooden wall, or a stone wall. So you decide however you want it to be. It's that simple. And remember, all you have to do is hold on to the mouse button. And the hammer does all the work for you. Just don't let go of the mouse button. As long as you have the inventory in stock, it'll build. Let me grab some more logs. And on the last hit, the house becomes decorated on the inside. And this is our simple house. A little bit of every type of style you can build. I don't recommend doing this if you want to keep your people happy. Just an example of what you can do. And that is it for this lesson. If you have any comments or questions or anything or ideas for future videos, please let me know. Giving you the knowledge, it's up to you what you do with it.